Well, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to July 20th, the 50th anniversary of the landing on the moon. The eagle has landed. Isn't that something? 50 years ago. That's crazy. So, needless to say, we're going to take ourselves a street glide ride. I want to go down, just go do my old train route thing. Hope that's okay with you guys, but that's just what I feel like doing today going through them vlogs and I keep hearing Jeff's uh, switchback running and all I can think about is taking the old street glide for a ride man hearing that Harley you guys watching that those videos and you hear that Harley running through there that just makes the hair on the back of my neck stand up man this is switchback sound good that whirring of the motor and that cool exhaust note just music to my ears so anyway that's my motivation to take my dusted out street glide for a ride. Y'all come on along. Holy moly, is this thing comfortable? God almighty. Oh, Lord. Does this feel good? Wow. Just some low RPMs and just crazy crazy. Crazy comfort. Man. I didn't take any back roads. I just decided, what's this thing like going down the highway at highway speeds? Man. Man, don't get me wrong. That GSA is not uncomfortable. But this is just like world class comfortable. Holy moly. Just my butt sitting in that big old comfortable seat and it just goes S -s -s oh, God. You guys wanna do some off-roading on the street glide? Why the heck not? Throw you in some sun first here. <laughs> Everybody's going, oh you you gonna get rocks in your belt and blah blah blah. Yeah. It's got to be smart. Oh, that was a, a live uh, blackberry. Live as in it was nice and fresh. Cars haven't come through and knocked all the stickers off yet. Man, just look how well that thing works on a bumpy dirt road. That's crazy. I thought I was going to take you through that gate, but that's not happening, is it? <laughs> I think they close at 6 here. I don't remember where I can see the lights, if I can see them from, from down here, or... Ah, oh, no, I gotta go farther down. I'll just go down here and turn around. So what do we got down here? We got a flashing orange over a red, and then no light over a red in the uh, left, left tracks. Ah, oh, it just went green. Let's, let's get down here and see if we can uh, see if we can catch it down at the small bridge. How about that? Kelly loves this little road that runs along here between uh, uh, Winlock and where this little uh, little private railroad crossing is. <laughs> What's the name of this road anyway? Farrier Road. Oh, it's the same road that the um, one lane little skinny bridge is. I didn't realize the. I, I figured once it made the turn at the top of the hill, it changed its name, but nope. It's so weird to have all this power at such low RPMs. It just gobs a torque, and I'm just loafing. No revving on these. Or you can, but it's not really necessary. Gotta love them. Then all my waiting, it'll probably be an Amtrak. Amtraks are okay, it's just they go fast and they're real short. They go shh, whoo, over. And I like a good old noisy racket making freighter to go by. Those are cool ones. Yeah, if it comes by, it's gonna be blasted into the sun. 
that's not no fun and it's not really a good place to park on the other side so what do we got I'm gonna make sure I don't go far enough I get dinged by the pole let's just drive out here in it I can see them before they get to me what do we got on this side for the northbound oh look at that northbound on the uh, right hand side here has a, a green over red so we we could get a twofer today wouldn't that be nice let's go check out the bridge while we're waiting look at that green over red southbound that's south we got a green over red on the other lane going northbound Something really does not smell good down here. Like that is brutally bad. God, that's beautiful. Boy, I mean that. <laughs> that is a strong smell. Mama. What in the world? Know what that is? That's a hog smell. Maybe this farmer guy here picked him up some hogs. Take a look at the other side here. See that BMW guy? He could give two F's that this is a one lane bridge. <laughs> he just came over. Gosh, it's a motorcycle. I don't need to worry about that. a scary place to pull to the side because there looks like there's a bunch of junk there I'm just going to shut this thing off for a second and listen nothing well I can't sit here like a knot so maybe we'll drive down to the uh, to the other crossing there we'll go farther south down by the little cream cafe I'm afraid as soon as I leave that's when they're gonna come barreling by oh no I missed the daggum northbound one son of a gun God, and I flew through there too. Look at that, call it right at the end. That's messed up. That son of a gun had to have literally come around the bend when I took off. I was like, whoa. Literally, the words almost came out of my mouth. It sounded like thunder, and it, a rifle goes off up there. You know, I'll just sit here for a little bit, and listen for, listen for horns. I'm in the shade. I can, I can handle this. Oh yeah, I can hear it a roaring. She's a coming. She's about to come barreling around the bend, and it's going to be on. Hold on. It's going to be on this track. Does that not sound like a monster coming or what? He's got a green light so he can go full speed through here if he wants. And he is moving it looks like. I'm going to step back. This is going to look cool. Yeah. With my old hog in the way. Yeah, he's moving. He's flat moving. Oh, 
yeah, look at that. That looks creepy. That, my friends, is what makes trains exciting. Yeah, buddy. Now my day is fulfilled. <laughs> All right. There's just something about Harleys and trains. <laughs> Why is that? Just good old American iron or what? won't hold that was perfect absolutely perfect mm. beautiful day couple trains riding on my hog I got the last of the crazy videos done today so this road is blocked but it's blocked just on the other side of Telegraph Road so uh I can at least make it that far and take those back roads. He hauls out there mixing it up with the moo cows. It's weird how dry looking this place can get. The place that rains that much, you think there'd be enough reserve moisture in the ground that no grass would ever not be green oh what a beautiful day so nice to be out on my old street glide love you old gal that's pretty crazy uh meeting up with the guy that works at the uh at the cedar mill, huh? There we go. Last time I came by this old barn, the sun wasn't setting on her. That is cool. That looks real nice. Sorry if this is noisy. I'm riding along with my face shield up. Feels very good. That little breeze blow on your eyeballs. Or on your face. I'm wearing those motorcycle glasses, so they're like little mini goggles. So you don't get stuff in your in your eyeballs. Man, I am so comfortable. I just want to keep going, but I need to build yesterday's vlog and maybe if I'm really ambitious, get this one going as well. Or at least get it prepped and ready to go. Well that Mount St. Helens has lost so much snow and there's like a haze in the sky. I can barely even see her. I won't even bother pointing that out. My favorite little downhill run. Something very peaceful about how this thing slopes down. You can ride along, no hands, and the bike just glides its way through it. way more seat time on this gal she sure is something special tags expire on it next month the iron this month I think the truck is this month I think the 48 is next month isn't it I don't know Whatever. Seems like my tags always hit about the same time. When I did the brake bleed on this thing, didn't I take that lever off and lube it? I don't know if you guys hear the rattling. It's my clutch lever. It's like the pivot's dry, but I could have swore I took the pivot off and lubed it. But I mean, even, even sounds dry. That's part of your service, by the way, is to lube those. In fact, I think they even have you do it every 5,000 miles. Keep them all happy and lubed. They 
say technicians take the worst care of their own motorcycles. I don't want to be one of those guys. <laughs> all right. I'm going to bust on up the hill. I hope I don't have to follow this camper all the way up. hope he takes the I-5 cutoff here. If not, it's going to be a slow ride up the hill. Yeah, he's going to take it. This is where uh, David Andrews and I said our our final goodbye he headed out to see his family and I headed up to go see my family all right I'll talk to you guys here in just a little bit thanks for coming along on the old street glide love this old gal that's why she's in my garage <laughs> Well, hello there, YouTube. Man, what a beautiful day. It is gorgeous. And the other thing that makes the day really special is I got the last of the big vlogs done. Used up two full days of my vacation building those things. But they're done, so they're, that's good. They're done. And I hope you like them. Looks like you guys are liking them. Man, doing that kind of vlog every day would be... Yeah, that, yeah. I couldn't do it. No. I it, literally could not do vlogs like that every day. No, not every day. But yeah couple times a week or something I have to learn some kind of workflow uh, that's just too much footage to spend a whole day riding a motorcycle and doing different things that's just that's that's a lot of footage yeah <laughs> I do bad enough just going on my little hour ride you know even half hour ride can be a little much to deal with yeah but anyway it was fantastic taking the old street glide for a ride again man that thing that's a cushion. I've just been going on, probably driving Kelly nuts. It's that so thing. so smooth and cush. Man, that is a touring motorcycle right there. Oh, yeah. Man, that's really nice. She's going to get her day to go out for a trip at some point. Oh, yeah. That'd that, be that'd nice. That would have been really nice to have that on the on the trip. Oh, well. Yeah, not that the BMW was uncomfortable or anything, no. but uh, it's just something special about taking a trip on a Harley. There's something special about riding a Harley, period. Yeah. But anyway. Anyway, I'm going to get back. I'm going to try to get caught up on the vlogs before the work week starts on Monday. I don't mm -hmm. want to be messing around trying to play catch up on that. No, that's not fun. So I got, you know, the iron vlog and this this vlog, and I'll, I'll be caught up. Very good. So I'll try to get that most of it done tonight or first thing in the morning. Well, I'm not going to spend the whole day working on it. So. Yeah, that would be nice. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to bust out. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up, and you guys have an amazing Sunday or Monday. Heck yeah. All right. All right. We'll see you tomorrow. Take care. All right. Bye-bye now.